welcome back to my channel guys it's your girl coco styles and in today's video we're gonna do a how to style pleated skirt now i do have a skirt on now and this skirt is from mango mangoes is a really good it's almost like um uh maybe a zara a little bit better quality than zara in my opinion um but it's still high street but i'm gonna start with this skirt here the focus is going to be on the skirts, so I do not have on shoes. However, I will take a picture in some shoes that I would actually wear this with. So this skirt is in a large. I am six feet, so I do not like short skirts. So I would typically go for something like this. Um, the top that I have on is from Zara. This is just a basic Zara top. Um, where I am in Atlanta, it's not that cold. So I wouldn't wear this by itself. I would actually throw something on over it, maybe a jacket or maybe a like a, a cape or something like that. So this is the first skirt. You can wear it by itself or you can wear it with a belt. Um, I do have it on with a belt that I got from Zara. Uh, this belt, I believe I featured it in my last haul um i ended up keeping it it's a tad big but i do like the belt so this is the skirt it is a faux leather skirt i like the finish of the skirt it's not too plastic looking if that makes sense um it does have a little bit of like a faux material inside this is not sweat or anything so you won't sweat or anything under this um it comes down to my shin maybe and again i am six feet so if you are taller than i am i'm sorry shorter it may come down a lot further so this is how i would wear it on just a regular day where i'm just going out probably for like brunch or something Maybe some nice earrings, a couple of bracelets, and possibly pumps if it's not too cold. Um, if I'm going to wear something like this, I wouldn't wear this particular one by itself, but they do have some that come out a little bit further. But what I would do with this is I would actually throw on just a cover up over me. And this is just a cape. So... I would just throw this on over me and just go out for the day. You could actually put your arms through this one. I'm gonna see if I can find where I bought this or if I can find it online for you guys. But I struggle to get it on. It's actually a leather like cape. Um, I believe it's BCBG. I do. I think it's BCBG, I'll double check, but something like this, you can just throw over you and just be done. If I decided to wear this shirt and didn't want to take this off, I can leave it on just like this. If I want it, I can wear maybe a long sleeve, basic body suit, just a sleek finish, no, de no real detail in it, anything like that. Just keep the look kind of sleek and finish, throw on some boots and they're out the door. So. This is how I would style this skirt. This color is like a, like a camel color. So you can probably do this with like a denim jacket if you wanted to dress it down, a white tee. And if you want it, you could actually wear some sneakers with this. Um, I am not a sneaker head. However, I do love shell toes. And that's probably something that I would throw it on with if I just wanted to just look a little chic and down for the day, but still, you know, like a lady. With a, with a skirt on. So this is how I would actually style this. And let me know what you guys think. Um, if this is something that you would wear or you would style this way, let me know if you have any other suggestions on how you would style it, but this is how I would style it. And like I said, with some boots and I'm done. So what I'll do is I'll give you guys a another look with this particular skirt um you i could take this belt off honestly if i wanted to switch it over for let's see i could switch it over for what is this this is the 
infamous Gucci marmot belt. Um, I'm not really a fan of this belt anymore. I did get the smaller one because the other one was just a bit too large for me. Um, you can wear it like this again with some same tall boots. That would be perfect. Um, actually, they don't even have to be super tall because I don't know if you guys can actually see my feet. Like I said, I am six feet. So this comes down rather long, but you can wear some booties with this if you want it. And like I said, out the door and boom, here's your outfit. So that's another belt you can wear with this. You can definitely dress this up or dress this down if you want it. So that's what I would do with this particular one. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I am going to try on the black one that I have here. Um, let you guys see that. Also, if you didn't want to be like super dressed up, like I said, you can wear some sneakers with this if you want it. Um, I'm probably going to post pictures on my social media, most likely. And you guys can follow me there at the underscore Coco, C-O-C-O, -C -O, underscore Styles New York. Um... I'll link that. So if you want it, you can wear it like this. I did take off the belt because I wouldn't wear the belt with this, but you can wear something like this if you want it. Same boots if you want it or some sneakers, like I said. So it just depends on what you're going for that particular day. Um, there's so many ways. I realized that coming from New York City, I try to get away from leather pieces <laughs> But it's just in my blood, guys. I don't know. I guess it's because I am a New Yorker till the day I die. But I love leather pieces. I don't care what it is. I just need a little bit of leather. And I know it's not the most feminine thing because it can look a little harsh. But it's just something that I love and it's just my style. Um, but I do like other things but something about leather that i just keep in my rotation i always buy a jacket every year regardless of where i'm at so like i said that was look number one so i'll be back with the other skirt in black and let you guys know how i style that see you in a second welcome back guys so i did end up changing my earrings to something a little bit more bright and bold because I kept on the same top. Now the skirt is black. Um, now, a word of advice, guys. If you decided to buy any fold of the skirts, make sure that it doesn't smell one because I've heard stories about, about skirts smelling like some sort of fish. I don't know. And um, make sure it's not super shiny. So I would prefer vegan leather just my preference, um, cause sometimes the other PU, I think it's called PU leather, it just has a really weird smell. So this is one way of styling this, um, in my opinion. I'm gonna come back with the next look with the same skirt. And this is another way I would style it. And again, something like this, I would probably throw a belt over this. Um, you can keep it really sleek, wear uh, a blazer over this, or even, a graphic tee and some sneakers maybe and possibly a uh, another throw over you if you do not like sneakers you can definitely wear like some booties if the weather permits probably some strappy shoes right so that's it guys so I'll be back with the next look in a second I'll see you in a second welcome back guys okay so Here's my other look. I just threw on a basic white button down shirt. It's not super tailored, but um, it does have some room in it. So, which I do like, I just threw on a waist belt over it. This is a very decent belt, It's kind of stretchy. So it was not gonna really suck you in like a corset, but you can pull the string around. So this is my other look. I would wear something like this again, just with some boots and keep it really, really simple. If I did not like, if you don't like something like this, you could actually 
wear something like, let's see, you can probably wear, if you're more of an edgy person, more of an edge to your style or whatever, you could always throw on one of these, which I don't even know what you call these things. You could wear something like this. This I had for some time. So if you wanted to do something like this, you could, um, it just depends. You can pull this a little tighter if you want it. And simple. You could wear it like this, or you could wear it with the other belt, depending on what you're going for. Um, there are hats and stuff that you can wear with stuff like this. You could also wear something like this. I guess I consider this like a belt, some sort of belt suspender thing. But you can also wear this with paint jeans if you wanted to keep it simple. But that's also how I would style this one. And let me see what else. I could, you could also take the same, same exact top and the same skirt and probably throw back on the same leather jacket if you wanted to. You can throw the same leather jacket on if you want it to. And you can actually tie this up if that's something that you don't like. <laughs> don't do it. But you can tie it up and wear it like this. Of course, wear it a little bit tighter, but you can do something like this and simple outfit. Something simple, chic, almost like schoolgirlish kind of, if you really think about it. And this you can wear sneakers with because this jacket is so sporty, but I'm not gonna lie, you can still get away with wearing some boots with this. So that's another way I would style that. And let's see. And that's about it. I actually. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm actually going to finish this haul out with just throwing on a simple black top. Um, nothing too much because I actually want to show you guys this cardigan here. Don't mind the wrinkles. Mango sent this over, and it's like, sorry, they didn't send it over. I purchased this. Um, and I got it in the mail and it was just folded up really tight. So I'm going to show you how I would style this cardigan. Um, I just wanted to add it in this video because it goes with the color of this other skirt. So give me a second and I'll be right back showing you guys this and how I would actually style this cardigan. So I'll be back guys. Welcome back guys. So I just threw on the cardigan. I would not wear it with this skirt. However, this sweater, um, my arms are not like super long, but I would not wear this sweater folded down. I think it's supposed to be short anyway. But what I would do is, if it is really nippy outside, I would definitely wear some gloves with this. Sorry guys, I have on a watch. Try to pull this over. I would definitely wear it with something like this. Um, really simple. I think I got these from, these are old, these are H&M. Like old. If anybody knows where I can get longer leather gloves from, please link that below. So I would wear it with something like this and simple. Like I said, I love leather pieces, guys. <laughs> I do. So I would wear some gloves and possibly a hat. This is a BCBG hat. 
that I bought some years back. And I wouldn't necessarily wear it with a bang, of course, but I definitely like the fact that the brim of the hat is leather and then I have a leather glove. So these are the looks for today, guys. Just a, just a few things that I wanted to show you guys how I would style these pleated leather skirt, well, faux leather skirts and how I would style a cardigan. Um, I did use a basic white button up and I, I believe, oh yeah, this is the basic Zara turtleneck. I think these are new, but they are the same material as the tank tops that they have. So these are a must. These are a must have. So that's it guys for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys like videos like this, please comment below more try on hauls for tall women or whatever. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button guys. And I will see you guys in the next one. If you stay to the end of this video, please comment. Coco, we see you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.